So for about 53 minutes there, five on five, pretty much accomplished what this team set out to do against these guys? Yeah, we're, we're a team playing four and six nights, uh, get bag skated through the trip, uh, through a lousy game in Seattle, travel. I'm proud of the team. Uh, we don't find a way to finish the game. The penalties are, that was a key thing in our first time we played them was staying out of the box, hurt us tonight. Does Noah Cates just continue to surprise you night after night when he's given assignments like this? And yeah. Excel there? He doesn't surprise me anymore. Okay. He, he, uh, he continues to get better. He's not afraid of anything. And, uh, uh, and, but I, I'm going to tell you, it's, not, it's just not Noah. I'm, I thought the team laid it out there and uh, did all the things we asked of them, checked. Uh, we, we played a hard game and uh, just couldn't find a way to win. When you think about what you're trying to build long term, how important was it to get back to that identity after hitting a low point in that Seattle game? Yeah, and I think we've built from Seattle. Since that Seattle game, we've just kept on playing and uh, uh, playing the right way. Uh, sharp on the bench tonight. We checked. We were above the puck. Uh, we did all the things to win a hockey game, and uh, we don't find a way to do it. But uh, I, I think the group uh, through this trip, it's been a long trip, uh, has have handled themselves so very well. You mentioned, I guess, a couple of nights ago about it was important for you to kind of catch them when they were slipping and not let it go off the rails. Why do you think they were able to catch themselves and get back on the work ethic and also well, get it back? I, the I think I, I think it's it's it, they've been that way all year long. Uh, when it's a even when we've lost some clunkers, it it, it really hasn't been effort. Uh, these, these Seattle, again, the two Seattle games were just uh, uh, just funny games for us as far as just not being there mentally. And, um, but I, as I've said, and when we talk about this, one of the biggest things we're trying to build here uh, is the work habit, uh, is the standard of what is expected, how you play, no matter if you win or lose, just the standard of how you play. And, you know, there hasn't been many bitches by me during the year. And, uh, so we gotta, we got to keep on going, keep on believing in how we play, and try to, find a way, try to find a way to win some games. Before the game, you mentioned how much of an impact losing TK has. How do you feel like the team adjusted to that? Tonight? Yeah, I, I, I think when you lose a player like TK, uh, you, become, you have to become more of a team. Uh, you have to play a style more of a team. Uh, you know, we're not a team full of game breakers. Uh, TK is one of those for, for us when, when he's on. So, and against a team filled with them, uh, you, you just have to play in your concept and, and play that good as a team. And uh, the two Edmonton games, the two, we, I think we played them, what, a couple of week and a half, two weeks ago. I think it's two of the games we've been so focused uh, uh, on how we have to play. And so I give our team a lot of credit, although we lose tonight. One or two more. Is that a great example for you when you're playing against superstars? And like you said, you just had TK, but you guys are able to stay with them neck to neck. Yeah, yeah. It, 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 I just hope they can hang their hat on it in, in how we had to play tonight. And uh, it's away from the puck. It, we talked a lot about the defensive side of the puck. And uh, sometimes players get bored uh, uh, with that part of the game. They want to go offensively. We're just not built that way. Uh, so I hope, I hope as we go through, uh, they can lean on some of these things when we have some struggles. And, and uh, uh, yeah, so we'll just keep on plugging away here.